Hello everyone, welcome to another episode of Brother Not Brother. In today's episode, we're going to be trying popcorn. All of the popcorn. All of the popcorn. We went to the grocery store and bought every popcorn that they had. Well, brand. Not all of the popcorn, but every brand. Every brand. Um, as you can nine. see, we have quite the layout here. And we're going to figure out which one is the best. Yes. We're going to put them all to the test. Flavor. Color. Crunch. Crunch. How they cooked. Yeah. How well they cooked. Like we, so we threw all these. Kelby did. Kelby did all the work on this one. He threw them in the pop, the in the popcorn maker, also known as a microwave, and just hit the popcorn setting. And then did not let follow the instructions on, on here. each one. Just we just hit the setting. Because I think if you have a popcorn setting on a microwave, they should all be programmed for that. Because everyone has a popcorn setting on their we'll microwave. See, because that one look. Some of these look a little bit crispier. Yeah. Okay, well, uh, do we want to start on the right or to the left? Let's start with over here. All right, we have our Orville Redenbacher's Natural Light Classic Sea Salt and Butter. Um, we it's tried to find- Classic butter and sea salt. Classic, classic butter and sea salt, sorry. I can't read. <laughs> I don't have my glasses on. Um, but this one, uh, we, we tried to go with just like the butter flavor on all of them. It's extremely white. This is a very white one. <laughs> Pretty good. It's nice. It's pretty light on the salt. But I do like the sea saltiness. Let's see. Like that. What do you think? Pretty good. I like salty. Yeah. I don't taste butter. Uh, this box also for a pack of three, two dollars. That makes it twenty-two cents an ounce, or sixty-six cents, sixty-six cents per bag. Um, not a bad deal. I think there's some better deals. Yes. Um. And then we'll rank these somehow at the end. Mm -hmm. Next we have uh, Food Club. Food Club. I think this is a uh, Harmon's brand. So put the signing out that way. And this one's a lot yellower. Yeah, it looks Actually, more like what I imagine yellow. with like buttered popcorn is like yellow popcorn. Oh. Mm -hmm. That's super generic. Not, not a lot of more. Not more butter. No butter. Not much salt. I like the saltiness of that Orville, but yeah, we are we did get a buttered popcorn. Yeah. It's crazy how much variety there is in the color the color of popcorn. Butter, yes, salt, yeah. or any other flavor. Mm -hmm. No, it's kind of black, right? Next, we have our popcorn or pop secret, but uh, popcorn butter flavored. Yeah. Oh, hey, by the way, dollar forty nine, fifteen cents per uh, ounce. This is the cheapest one. Um, so pop secret. What are you? Two sixty nine. 28 cents an ounce, 89 cents a bag. So some bags are more expensive, some bags are bigger, smaller, um, which is kind of interesting. I thought all popcorn bags would be the same size. Ooh. I yeah. like that. It's a light buttery, but it's definitely like a buttery that feels like it's coating the flavoring receptors on my mouth. I feel like these are bigger. Mm hmm. Bigger kernels. Like, look at that one kernel, it's huge. So far, Pop Secret is my favorite. Yeah, I really like it. Light butter, but you get mm -hmm. it on your tongue. Yeah. Delicious. Next one, we have our Cousin Willie's Simply Better with real butter. I've this never is, heard of this one before. This is the most expensive one at $3.27 uh, per box, $1.09 per bag, 43 cents an ounce. Now this one, I just did the popcorn setting and it looks a little burnt. Yeah, it is not burnt, crispy. but yeah, the edges, I guess. Yeah, it's got some crispy to it. Oh. Whoa. Okay. I kind of like this one. I, I don't know. The artificial pop secret is starting to come out after this. Like this feels like this is real butter, and like I want to taste real butter now. And this is really, really real butter. It's good. It's not burnt. Move it, popcorn. Like, let me bring this around to the camera. One of these ones you can see. Uh, you can kind of see there's a little bit of like black specking, and I think that's just the kernel that stuck to the outside of it here. Interesting. Focus on my level here, huh? No, focus on the popcorn. Yeah, you. You see that? Yeah, you can kind of see that. That is definitely a different buttered flavor. Mm hmm. Um, I definitely think it's. I think it's one of the better. But it's actually, it, it, that is real butter. Mm-hmm. Okay. Old Redenbarker's, he says real, it's not real. Yeah. 
I think they went a little light on their uh, butteriness. But that one is, wow. Next we have the most buttery looking one, yes. Jolly Time Blasto Butter. Um, they don't have like a regular butter, it's just like Blasto Butter. When I eat popcorn, I can't just like, who, who eats it one at a time? You gotta take it by like a handful and just <laughs> I have to say, for as yellow it is, I'm a little underwhelmed by the butteriness. How much is this one? $2.66, 20 ounce. Okay, so $2 a box, 66 cents a bag, 20, ounce, uh, 20 cents per ounce. More buttery flavor than ever. I mean, it's not bad. No, I'd definitely eat it, but yeah. it's definitely no Cousin Willie's. No, definitely not. Interesting. It looks right. like cheddar butter, a uh, cheddar popcorn. Yeah, it is. Those big just like that you get super bright. Let's compare this to like Orville Redenbacher yeah. or like our Kroger brand, or not Kroger, Food Club from Harmons, and even like the real butter from Cousins. Like it is so yellow. It looks like the Big Ten from Christmas. <laughs> yeah. Something. That's exact. Yeah. yeah. It almost looks like the cheddar one. Next one is our Kroger brand of popcorn. This is original butter, 125, 41 cents, and 13 cents. 13 cents per bag. That's one of the cheaper ones there. Ooh, Ooh. I like that one. Mm-hmm. That has the exact same flavor. Yeah. Of, of butter, but more prominent. I like this one. I think like better. I like the butteriness of this popcorn. I love me some buttered popcorn, and that is on it. That's pretty good. Mm -hmm. Next one. We're going um, healthy. Healthy. With skinny, skinny Pop. Skinny Pop. $2.99 a bag, a Nin box. 99 cents a bag. 35 cents per ounce. This is another lighter one, but not nearly as white as that overall horrible Redenbacher. It's been like bleached over there. Very plain. I taste sweetness to it. No, yeah. it tastes like they're skinny. Pop. Almost like they're trying to do like a kettle almost. Yeah, it didn't work. I don't like it. It's okay. It's the most bland of them. But I don't know. I wonder. I think I'm gonna jump back to this one. Ooh. Those taste the same. The uh, food club tastes the exact same as the skinny pop. Like, Food Club is definitely more yellow than the... It tastes almost the exact yeah. same. Yeah. That's weird. All right, so now we got like one of those like trendy brands. Boom Chicka, Chicka Pop. Pop. Boom Chicka Pop. However, the thing that was unique about Boom Chicka Pop was the bag. Yeah, so those normally you open the bag like this, it tears open, you get this opening here. This one, you pull and you ripped it open like like a Ziploc bag almost. Yep. And then it works kind of like a bag of popcorn from the movie theater for you. Mm. Ooh, not bad. Got some Whoa. decent flavor. We're running out of room. Oh, whoops. Is horrible even in? No. I don't know. Let's do some like staggering here. Just... There we go. Mm. I like that one. Mm -hmm. it tastes better. I like the flavor of the corn better. Like the corn is noticeably better on that. It's not super buttery though, but it's really not good. Not good. Hey. All right. Act two. Act two. Guy is, I think it's down here. 287, 47 cents, 17 cents. Oh, did we talk about how much this one was? This is 319, 79 cents, and 24 cents a bag, which is still cheaper than our uh, cousin Willie's. Willie's. So this is right. Act Two. Act Two. Well, I think this is probably one of the more popular ones. Act Two and Order, Orville Red and Top Secret. Uh huh. Uh -huh. Not 
buttery at all. It says butter on the bag, but I don't taste butter. After eating all these other butter popcorns, that's the least buttery of the butter popcorn. Like even the skinny pop is better. It has more butter in it. Yes. I don't know which one to do. Cause all of them taste. Mm -hmm. I'll be honest. My flavor palette. I'm between Cousin Willie's and Boom Chicka Pop. Top three. Top three. Cousin Willie's. Boom Chicka Pop. I like Cousin Willie's, mm -hmm. Boom Chicka Pop, mm -hmm. and then Kroger's. Yeah, Kroger Kroger's was really good. Was this one. I'm just going down the line real fast, and Cousin Willie's definitely stands out. Uh huh. Kroger. So good. I just, like, honestly, Boom Chicka Pop is my favorite. But I agree with you. The Kroger brand is a really good one too. We're gonna bring them up on top of this skinny pop. So we got our top three here. Everybody else is just imposters. Can you even see those? I don't know. Just maybe. That was a uh, quick run through, but a lot, uh, of popcorn. a lot of popcorn. We're gonna be snacking and watching movies the rest of the day. Yeah. As you can hear, there's a movie going on in the background with the kids with their uh, flavor, their uh, samplings of all of our popcorn. Yeah. Let us know which popcorn is your favorite. But uh, if you're looking for a suggestion, go get yourself some Boom Chicka Pop, or maybe even some Cousin Willie's. Yes. In the meantime, we'll see you in the next episode. Check us out on all of our social media. Thank you for your support on Patreon. If you want to support us too and get exclusive behind the scenes and uh, extra access, you can go there. Patreon.com slash brother, not brother. We'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.